Oh my god, look how sick. Do another wheelie. Slow down for the railroad tracks. Yeah, that was fun. Hey, everybody. Uh, just now leaving work. I know I said the next video that I would do would be a gear video, but uh, when I shot it, it both looked and sounded like crap. So I'm going to redo it, and I'll put it out sometime this weekend, I'm sure. Probably Friday. Uh, today's Wednesday. Guess what day it is? But, uh, so anyway, so something come across my mind today. Somebody was talking to me. So here's another uh, little bit of motivation for you. So... I'll start out by saying this. For me to be my age, I've had a, a good bit of number of jobs. Um, part of that's because I used to work for like a temp service trying to get a job. And that's basically they'll stick you somewhere where basically they just need help for like a week or two. And, but they don't tell you that. They're like, hey, if you work hard, you'll get hired. So you work really hard. And like a week or two later, they lay everybody off. Uh, so anyway, so I've done a lot of jobs. I've worked retail, I've worked in factories, uh, I've worked in a prison, I worked there a long time. Uh, I've been in the military, I've had a lot of jobs. And when I say this next part, I'm sure someone's gonna pop in your mind that you're thinking of if you have any sort of job. Uh, but basically, every job that I've ever had, there's been this type of person where it doesn't matter what their job is. They could have got hired for just sit down and shut up for 12 hours, eight hours a day, whatever it is. We're gonna pay you normal wages. All you have to do is sit there. Just sit there and be quiet. And that's an amazing job, an easy job, you know. And this type of person, two weeks into this will be like, why do I gotta shut up? I'm tired of being quiet. And they just start complaining about everything. And every job I've ever had, I've had this type of person there. And the problem with that is, it, it, at first you can ignore them. But after a while, you start slipping into that. You start listening to them, to them and agreeing with them. Because you, you gotta keep it out of your head, because if you don't, they'll get to you. And today I found that happening and I realized what was going on, you know, I kind of caught myself and I was like, what the crap, you know? Be happy you have a job. If you don't have a job, you know, you're struggling. And to, especially in today's market, just be happy that you have a job. But there's those type of people out there, every single job I've ever had, that just complain about everything. Now, don't get me wrong, I'm not saying don't complain. I complain sometimes, but it's at least something important or something I believe that complaining will change. Unless I'm just super tired, I become a little bitch. But for the most part, you know, complain about something that you think complaining will change it. Or that you can change it. If not, what good does that do? It just brings everybody else's day down. And you can't live life like that. I mean, honestly, I, 
How depressed do you get? What are you doing, guy? Okay. I mean, that's got to be depressing just to constantly live your life like that, just whining and whining and whining and whining. Yes, I know I'm whining about whiners, but it's annoying. And I'm hoping this will get out there and catch on. Uh, so anyway, yeah, uh, there's a little bit of motivation. If you have a job, be, be freaking happy you have a job. I just wanted to show that. Never touch the clutch. Just wanted people to see that, see how that's done. <clears throat> anyway, okay, also moving on. Well, hang on, I love this on ramp. Let me play. Let me play for like two seconds. This is the one in the intro. <laughs> Okay, so anyway, moving on. Uh, what else? Um, we're pretty close to uh, 50 subscribers now, and we're also pretty close to a thousand views. So, you know, thanks a lot for the support, everybody. I really appreciate it. Uh, I like doing this a lot better than, say, Facebook or something like that. This is a kind of free therapy. I can rant and rave and you know, if you agree with me, you agree with me. If you don't, you don't. But uh, also, you know, if you're on some social media site like Facebook or something like that, you put your thoughts out there and, you know, a couple of your friends will respond unless you're just some hot chick or, or you're dying. Um, but at least on here, you know, you got like-minded people. You're talking about the same sort of things, you know. We get good conversations going. I think that's what most of the other social media sites, they promise that's the allure that they're promising, but they never really fulfill that promise. Uh, at least doing this, I've kind of, I get to blow off some steam and meet new people. It's been pretty cool meeting all these other uh, moto bloggers and, and cyclists and just people that's watching. Holy crap, look at those clouds. That looks like rain. Sucks. I don't know if you can see that in the camera, but it looks like like a volcano exploded up ahead or something But yeah, anyway, uh ADD right But uh, so yeah, thanks for the support guys uh, Whenever I hit about a hundred subscribers or when I hit a hundred subscribers, we'll probably do something cool like uh, Like a gift card giveaway or something like that, you know so But anyway Thanks for watching, guys. I hope this uh, hope it motivated you. It's Wednesday. We're almost there. It'll be Friday before we know it. So, all right, guys. Thanks for watching. Have a good one. See you on the next vid.